What is going on guys and welcome back to another unboxing video. I know it's been a few days, um, I have been busy, I've been playing Cyberpunk quite a bit and obviously work and things like that. Um, but yeah, I know I haven't really been uploading uh, just because there's already tons of Cyberpunk videos out there so there's, you know, there's no chance for me really. I think I'll just post easter eggs and stuff like that. But today we are going back to another unboxing video and this is um, another product sent to me by High Feast Store and they reached out to me on Instagram. They did do this a while ago so I do apologise um, for taking this long to do this unboxing video but we're finally getting around to it guys. Um, but yeah they were kind enough to send me out this headset to do um, a review on and you know test out and my honest opinion really which is you know what they they know um, I'm going to do basically they do reach out and they say you know your honest opinion you know it helps us to do a new product blah 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 you know things like that guys so um, it is the AX365 uh, 7.1 gaming headset I will leave a link to the product and their website in the description down below so you guys can check them out apologies there is no discount code um, right now but they may give me one at a different time you never know guys but um, it is at $38 I believe that's roughly 32 33 pound UK I'm not sure uh, don't quote me on that Google it or something um, but this is just the, the brief information on the website interface wired USB plug-and-play retractable and ro rotatable microphone adaptive head beam no drivers needed multifunctional control so um, it sounds you know like a pretty decent headset to be fair um, let's have a look at uh, let's have a look at the reviews. Uh, sound quality of the earphones is great. Uh, the black looks cool. Um, yeah, so there there is only a couple of reviews right now on the website, but we're gonna jump straight into it ourselves, guys. Um, here it is, AX three six five. As you can see, um, the box is a bit battered, but I just think that was just from uh, transport. But um, yeah, it's similar information on the box anyway, but let's jump straight into it. Uh, da, da, da. Also, I hope you all are doing well. Uh, you know, crazy times again during this crazy pandemic, especially leading up to Christmas. But uh, hopefully you are all doing well. And if you want to talk, feel free, leave a comment, message me on Instagram. I am very active over on there, so I will reply. Don't you worry. As long as it's not, can you send me a PlayStation or I won't reply. But, um, right, straight away, there's the headset, guys. So we're going to get it out. Oh. Okay. There's the headset. There's a little manual inside. Obviously, we don't need manuals. Not for a headset. Uh, it's a brief one, yeah. Plug in and play. So this one is basically for PC, I believe. Um, when I did ask them... Does it work on PlayStation? They said it should. <laughs> that, that, that was their um, answer. So um, I guess we'll find that out today. Oh God, this is a long, long cable. Okay, so it is USB, so it might work in the console. Uh, we'll give that a go, but obviously we will be testing it on the PC. So um, here is the headset, guys. Uh, it looks pretty sturdy, to be fair, you know, decent headset. Um, the extenders for anyone with a larger head, such as myself. Well, it's more my hair. Um, but yeah, so the headset itself looks pretty okay. Is this the microphone yet? So, retractable mic, and then you can move it about and such like that. So, to be fair, it would come in handy for like Discord and stuff like that. Um, we have uh, the like the mic panel, I, I guess. I, I don't know what people call these. Um, but has the volume up, down, mute, you have a bright light. Uh, I think this, because this lights up, I think when it's plugged in. We'll find out in a minute, guys, don't you worry. But um, there is that part. Um, and then, obviously, you've got the rest of the cable, and it is uh, just basic standard USB. If it'll focus, because it just keeps focusing on my big head. Um, but yeah, so, looks-wise, looks okay. Let's um, let's try it on. Uh, let's um, adjust it to my head first. Um, that should be about fine. Yeah. Okay, if it feels alright, I can't like hear a lot, so that's another good sign. If you're 
gaming for hours. Um, yeah, it feels okay. Where's the mic's there? I I can barely see it. I thought the mic would have been a bit longer. Um, so it might be a struggle for people to hear you. I may have to test this out with a friend as well. But um, okay, feels all right. Let's um, see how well the sound does. Obviously, you guys are gonna not be able to hear it. Um, right, let's, let's see. Um, okay, so there we go. So it lights up there. Um, and yeah, it lights up on that side also. Yeah, setting up a device. Okay, and then, I mean, let's see. So that button is just to turn it on and off. So it's not too bad. Um, right, let's find just a video quickly in my um, things. Well, actually, I'll we'll just go with YouTube audio. Let's, let's see how well. Okay, so I've just had devices ready. Okay. Okay, the sound is pretty good, so you guys can hear that. That's just um, a YouTube audio track, so I can't get copyrighted for anything. Um, but yeah, it did work, you know. Um, the sound is very clear, so that's pretty good. Um, so we're going to actually test it out on the PlayStation. Um, obviously, they didn't have um, the exact answer for me when I asked. Um, right, let's turn the camera a bit more. That way. <laughs> um, so let's see if it does anything. Okay, so it is working. Um, right. Hang on. <laughs> God. This little tripod driving me up the bend. Okay, so there we go. Um, so yeah, you, who's using this headset? Where's my controller? Right. Um, let's see if it works through the PlayStation now, guys. And it does. So it works with the PS5. So I'm assuming it it would work with um, the PS4. It doesn't sound too loud. Um, I don't think you can really change that unless through your personal settings. Um, but if it works on PlayStation 5, I 100% assume that it works on uh, PlayStation 4 consoles, possibly Xbox. If it's USB, um, I've, I've got a feeling it'll work. Um, but yeah. So the, the product itself is pretty decent, it works. Uh, the only thing for me is probably the microphone. I'm just used to the microphone being a bit longer. So this is the one um, I'm currently using and I do have um, the PS5 one. But as you can see, the microphone is a bit longer and you can, you know, you know it's there in a way. But um, yeah, it's a pre pretty decent headset. For the price, maybe drop it a little bit, but it feels comfortable enough. You know, you got your little RGB on the side. Uh, looks pretty good on anything RGB really. Um, but yeah, decent enough headset. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, unboxing slash review. So out of 10, I'd rate it 7.5 to 8, um, in my opinion. Obviously let me know your thoughts down below. Do you like the look of the headset or anything like that? Do you want to see any more on it? Obviously I might have to test out the microphone with a friend. I'll just throw it on a party or something and test it that way. But um, I'll probably have a better review on Instagram because um, I will be doing a post or something like that pretty soon anyway. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, do subscribe. Links to the company all down below. They do mouses, um, headset, keyboards, you know, mouse pads, all sorts, guys. Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.